Dear viewer, in this video, I will teach you people how to do chi-square test of independence in R. So first of all, I will tell you people, why do we use chi-square test? So chi-square test of ind independence is used to analyze frequency table formed by two categorical variab variables. Pearson chi-square test for independence is applied to outcome that are arranged in tabular form or test for independence between two factors. The rows correspond to the level of one factor and the column to the level of other factor. The null hypothesis is that two factor are independent. It means that we will arrange one factor in, in we will give heading of one factor in column and heading of other factor in the row uh, below the column there will be the value so that value we will find the correlation between like uh, uh, correlation between these two values either they are dependent upon each another or not so now i will go to perform the test Let's go to, I, I have uh, a link from a website. You can find this link in my description box and import this data. So we will import this data and we will open the library gplot and we will convert this data into table. So now we have converted this data into table. So first of all, we will see what is the table. So look, we have converted data like this. Now we will go to make a balloon plot. So balloon plot is beautiful uh, visualization of the data. Now you can see the data in the table. Now we will make a mosaic plot now you can see this mosaic plot beautiful uh, wife share in house tasks and husband share and jointly they work together in their house now we will do other type of visualization like this now these we just uh, visualize five uh, rows so one two three four five the below below the line is negative and above the line is positive so wife is positive in laundry male and she's negative in tidying while um, jointly is positive so now we will perform chi-square test. So uh, dear viewer, we should remember when we are writing paper, we should remember this chi-square value, degree of freedom and p-value. We should write this in our paper. So now I can use, view some observation of some residual. So we can find correlation of chi-square residuals so now you can see so blue is positive correlation and red is negative you can see wife is positive correlated in laundry work and husband is positive correlation in repair of house holding things and both they work together in during holidays so we will watch this data in percentage and make their core plot so now you can see their correlation is also joint is positively correlated and husband work in repair of how to household sinks and wife work uh, in laundry 
and that's all there we were if you like my video you can subscribe to my channel and watch a lot of video uh, about uh, learning statistical analysis in r